I was having a conversation with a longtime client of ours, and we were discussing uh, if there are certain roles within an organization where personality really doesn't matter. I mean, eh, it's not going to be on the top five things that you think about when you think about hiring somebody. Uh, maybe it's somebody going to be QAing software, or maybe it's the accounts payable clerk. Um, you know, it could be that you're hiring a, as a researcher for, for cancer or somebody who's a software architect and you go, yeah, I don't know, eh, you know, I think any personality can be successful with that. I don't think personality matters in those jobs. And we had an interesting discussion because I could definitely take a position that says certain roles are absolutely tied to the nature of the personality of the person. Um, and you, <laughs> it makes a huge difference, you know, if you're looking at hiring somebody who's going to be in customer support or a receptionist or um, a salesperson going after new business, so a hunter salesperson versus somebody who's going to be taking care of current clients or an overlay position. Clearly, there are positions where personality is really at the top of the list, but an accounts payable clerk or somebody who's QAing the software? I mean, really? I mean, does personality really matter? And the answer is yes. Not because it affects how the person can do their job, but it affects how the leader can be effective in providing guidance and leadership to that person. Let's face it, no matter what the job is, you want to be able to understand the nature of the person, what they're strong in, where they might have challenges, what motivates them, how to communicate with them. Those things are all really important to be able to provide an environment that will allow a person to be successful in your organization. So even when the personality is not really mundane to the job, it is mundane for keeping people on board. And it was interesting because we, we've had a number of clients that literally have everybody go through the profile. And the, the CEO said to me, he said, you know, the positions like your QA and your accounts payable clerk and positions like that, typically their managers are not really plugged in on people. Their people skills are not tremendously developed. Let's face it, they probably had that job before they moved into the leadership role, and they just haven't developed that maturity as it relates to looking at people and understanding them. So getting that data, getting actionable data that allows them to be more effective leaders can be even more important to the person running the accounts payable department than it may be to the sales manager. So no matter what, whether you're hiring Einstein or Frankenstein, no matter what the position is, personality matters. And for literally the cost of one day's pay, you can have all the information that you would need to know how this person thinks, how they operate, how they communicate, and what you need to do to motivate them to be an effective member of your team for an extended period of time. Thanks for listening.